On October 10th, Tesla was spotted for the first time testing the CyberCab prototype at its Fremont factory in California, signaling that Elon Musk's long-awaited robo-taxi project is finally taking shape. But eagle-eyed fans noticed something unusual. The door design looked nothing like any current Tesla. Wide hinges, high arc movement, a possible hint of butterfly doors. That detail quickly reignited speculation that the upcoming 2026 Tesla Model 2 and CyberCab might share the same compact platform, and maybe the same dramatic door mechanism. So when Musk later hinted at butterfly doors for Model 2, the puzzles suddenly clicked together. Why would Musk choose such an exotic design for Tesla's cheapest model? How will it affect cost, safety, and everyday use? And could this design actually solve a real problem for drivers in tight urban spaces? We'll break it all down in today's video. From the engineering logic behind the new hinge system, to how it might change the way you enter, drive, and even maintain your car. Stay informed, not surprised. Subscribe to Auto Gear Shift and help us hit 12,345 subscribers, where data, design, and Elon's logic always come before the hype. How does Tesla's butterfly door actually work? At first glance, the 2026 Tesla Model 2's butterfly door may look like a stylistic flourish, a design play to attract attention. But a deeper look at its structure shows it's an engineering-driven innovation built for efficiency, safety, and practicality. The door opens at a 65 to 70 degree vertical arc, enabled by an off-centered dual pivot hinge system that lifts the panel both upward and outward in a smooth compound motion. The geometry provides a clearance radius of about 780 millimeters, compared to nearly 1,100 millimeters on a conventional side-hinged sedan door, cutting required lateral space by over 30%, a crucial improvement for urban environments where parking widths average just 2.4 meters in U.S. cities. Mechanically, Tesla's system combines one precision electric actuator rated for up to 18,000 open-close cycles with a miniature hydraulic piston delivering a lift force of 1.9 to 2.1 kilonewtons. Together, they create a balanced opening motion without the need for complex load distribution sensors or multi-link hinges like the Model X's Falcon Wing, which required seven individual sensors per door. This simplification cuts total parts count by 62%, reduces maintenance points, and slashes the production cost to about $1,200 to $1,500 per door, roughly 70% cheaper than the Model X system that cost nearly $5,000 per side to build and service. Each butterfly door weighs between 24 and 27 kilograms, a full 30% lighter than the Model 3's 36 to 38 kilogram steel panel doors. This weight reduction was achieved through the use of 7075T6 aluminum alloy in both the hinge and frame sections. This aerospace-grade alloy boasts a tensile strength of 570 megapascals and a yield strength near 500 megapascals, yet remains 40% lighter than high-carbon automotive steel. The result is not only faster actuation, but also lower inertial load on the hinge assembly extending its operational lifespan to an estimated 10 years or 150,000 cycles under normal use. The lighter mechanism also yields measurable energy savings. Each full open-close operation consumes approximately 0.15 kilowatt-hours, equivalent to 0.02% of the Model 2's estimated 40 kilowatt-hour battery pack, or about the energy needed to drive 120 meters. Over 10 years of typical use, around six openings per day, the cumulative energy draw would total only 330 kilowatt-hours, a negligible amount compared to total lifetime energy throughput. Moreover, by reducing door weight and frictional drag, Tesla's simulations suggest a 0.005 drop in drag coefficient, CD, improving aerodynamic efficiency enough to extend driving range by roughly two to three kilometers per full charge. Structurally, the butterfly door exceeds standard safety benchmarks. In compression tests, 
the assembly withstands 6.8 kN of lateral force, about 15% higher than standard side doors, ensuring crash resistance during side impacts. The reinforced hinge mounts distribute load across three anchor points tied into the Model 2's front A-pillar and roof rail, maintaining cabin integrity during a collision. So, is this the kind of innovation you've been waiting for in the Model 2? Comment. Yes, if the butterfly door's design impresses you. Or drop the feature name, in two to three words. You're most excited to see Tesla add next. Why Tesla's Butterfly Door Could Be a Lifesaver for Aging Drivers For many American drivers, the daily act of getting in and out of a car isn't just inconvenient, it's physically demanding. According to data from the National Institute on Aging, 2023, nearly 47% of U.S. adults aged 60 and above experience some degree of lower back discomfort linked to repetitive bending, while one in three report knee or hip stiffness that makes conventional sedan access difficult. Tesla's new butterfly door on the 2026 Model 2 appears to directly address that growing demographic challenge with a design that quietly merges style with biomechanical relief. The door's 1.45 to 1.6 meter vertical clearance allows older drivers to exit the car while maintaining an upright spine angle cutting lumbar compression by roughly 38%, according to internal ergonomic modeling. In traditional sedans, the required 40 to 50 degree forward lean multiplies spinal pressure 1.6 to 2.1 times compared to standing, which can trigger pain flare-ups or disc inflammation over years of use. By reducing the bend angle to around 20 degrees, Tesla effectively shifts this daily movement from a strain-heavy action into a natural stepping motion something that's especially valuable for seniors with reduced core stability or hip mobility. The gains don't stop there. The door's wide arc and dual pivot design also decrease knee torque by 35%, helping older adults who struggle with arthritis or meniscus degeneration. For context, that reduction in torque equals about 40 to 45 newton meters less force on the joint per movement a meaningful margin when repeated hundreds of times per month. In a 2024 Biomechanics Institute of Berlin test, test participants aged 55 to 70 cut their average entry-exit time from 4.2 seconds to 2.8 seconds, while their range of motion improved by 18%, suggesting smoother, more confident mobility. Tesla's engineers further leverage the butterfly layout to raise the seat base from 460 to 490 millimeters, bringing it close to crossover height. That allows a 100 to 105 degree hip to torso angle, the sweet spot recommended by the American Society of Biomechanics for minimizing lower back tension. For older drivers, this means less falling into a low seat and easier balance recovery when standing up a key safety factor that often goes unnoticed in vehicle design. How could the butterfly door redefine? What affordable Tesla really means? Tesla's next major experiment in cost engineering and perception design is already in motion. According to early production schedules leaked from Giga Berlin, the first functional prototype of the 2026 Tesla Model 2 equipped with butterfly doors is slated for reveal in quarter 2 2026, followed by homologation testing under EU NCAP's five-star safety benchmark. If all milestones align, mass production could begin as early as the fourth quarter of 2026, with customer deliveries in the first quarter of 2027. The pricing strategy is equally bold. Tesla plans to launch the base Model 2 at $25,000, with the butterfly door package costing an additional $1,200, or roughly 4.8% of the total MSRP, a cost footprint nearly unheard of for supercar-style mechanisms. For comparison, the Model X Falcon Wing added nearly $5,000 in hardware and service complexity, while exotics like the McLaren 720S or Ferrari LaFerrari require door mechanisms costing between $9,000 to $12,000 per unit. From a manufacturing standpoint, Tesla faces significant operational thresholds. 
The global production target for the Model 2 is expected to exceed 1.2 million units annually, meaning more than 250,000 full hinge and actuator sets must be produced each year. Rather than outsourcing to German or Taiwanese component firms, Tesla is reportedly preparing a dedicated hinge and actuator line at Giga Shanghai, projected to cut per unit logistics costs by 22%, and reduce lead time from 18 weeks to just six weeks. Still, scaling such a mechanism for a mass market EV introduces practical friction. Tesla's own service forecast notes that the butterfly hinge system may require recalibration every 80,000 kilometers, adding eight to 10% higher maintenance costs compared to traditional doors. In cold weather markets, particularly Northern Europe and Canada, where ambient temperatures can dip below minus 10 degrees Celsius, the system will require EPDM rubber seals with low temperature elasticity retention, increasing material cost by about $25 per car, but improving long-term durability by 17%. Despite these operational challenges, the move fits squarely into Musk's long-term branding calculus. Each Tesla model historically carries one signature design trait that defines its identity. The Falcon wing doors made the Model X a luxury icon. The Cybertruck's stainless exoskeleton made it an industrial statement. And now, the Model 2's butterfly door aims to blend practicality with aspirational aesthetics. Internally, Tesla refers to this as premium feel at low cost, PFLC a design philosophy targeting a 10 to 15% increase in perceived product value with only 3 to 4% added real cost. Market analysts see this as Tesla's way to combat shrinking differentiation in the $20,000 to $30,000 EV bracket. Rivals like BYD Dolphin, $16,000, and Volkswagen ID.2, $27,000, already dominate the affordability and reliability narrative. Butterfly doors on a budget Tesla. Some call it insane, others call it inevitable. The truth? It might be both. But one thing's clear. Elon's betting that emotion still sells in a world obsessed with range and price. Would you buy it for the look, the comfort, or not at all? Comment your pick. And while you're here, smash that like. Hit subscribe and turn on the bell so you won't miss what Tesla breaks next.